I spent $360 on a storage locker and I have no idea what's inside. No, I did see some pictures of this thing online and the reason why I got it is because there's an extremely dope bag inside, which I mean, just look at some of these pictures right here. How would you not want to go for this locker? And I mean, for 360 bucks, that's a steal to me. But yo, let's get inside this thing. It is a little small, okay? It is a tiny bit small. That's what she said. But listen, small, but hopefully mighty. Fingers crossed. All right, so let me show you why I spent this much money on this locker. It's because of this thing. Oh my God, it's flipping heavy. Check that out. Louis Vuitton suitcase. Dude, I have no idea if this thing is real or not. From the looks of it, I'm gonna say I don't think it's real. I'm not too, too sure. I might have to like look up some pictures online to like see. Some things that I'm noticing though, straight off the bat, this thing is kind of off. I feel like Louis Vuitton just wouldn't do something like that like this button right here the zipper seems okay it does seem a little flimsy and the material yeah i i don't know it's pretty sick though but yo let's let's see what's inside this thing i feel like there's definitely something inside it let's open this thing up hopefully we can find something oh yo Away. Oh, oh no way yo no. oh yo oh this just got interesting this just got really interesting <laughs> that's a safe <laughs> That's a safe. You gotta be me. You gotta be me. Yo, no flipping way. There's definitely something inside here. Dude, this is sick. Okay. <laughs> well, we got. Off the gun. We got something. Uh, I have no idea. How the heck are we gonna be able to open this thing? No flipping way, dude. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Let me see if there's anything else inside this bag really quick before we hop into that. Dude, this bag is actually really sick. Even if it's not real, I'm gonna I'm gonna look up some pictures online to see like comparison to stuff, but so far I'm gonna say it's not. I'm not an expert on Louis Vuitton or anything, but just to my knowledge, I'm gonna say no. Nice little suitcase, something like did break off right here. But dude, couldn't you see me going around in the airport with this thing? Like, say goodnight, dude, I'm on my way. Where are we going? You know where we're going? That's kind of dope. I like it. Hopefully we're going to the bank counter. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Super sick bag though. It has like these, uh... You not think what's in that safe? I'm, I'm, dying, I'm dying to see what's inside the safe. Right we got the nice little Velcro and stuff on the inside right here. Who knows? I mean, there's potential. That's all I'm saying. There's potential in that bag. Let's dive into this. Yo, we haven't even like really started in this locker. All I saw was the bag first and I just, I want to get in this safe. This is insane. What the heck is this little thing? Oh, there's a key slot right here. Okay, so can I just like twist this thing? with my finger how do you even can i just like don't bust it though try, try a combo all right try a combo nothing i'm gonna try 69 69 pound no <laughs> wait nothing I'll okay give, give me four ones can i just like pop don't, the lock on this thing don't do it oh. don't do it all right so there's definitely something in this safe. My hopes and dreams are to find a key inside this locker right now. Because if we can find a key, we can open this thing up and see what's inside. All right. Banger. Here we go. Banger right off the bat. Okay, so I did want to mention that we are doing a giveaway. We're giving away this off-white crew neck right here. You guys are going to see this upcoming in the video. We found some crazy heat in this locker. But for the steps for this video, all you guys have to do is go follow me on Instagram at Connor TV. Subscribe to the channel and go down the comments and comment off white. But yo, good luck on the giveaway. Let's get back into this. But yo, all right, also hopping in here, we did have this TV right here. Roku TV, Philips. Eh, nice little TV. I'm gonna say we got maybe 80 bucks right here on a solid day. Let's say Facebook Marketplace, maybe 50. All right, 50 bucks on Facebook Marketplace. Everyone loves TVs, right? Let's hop inside this bin right here though. What the heck is this? It says the closet. This is the closet bin right here. Looks like we got some cutting boards right here. Nice, I don't know what we're cooking in the closet, but oh snap, oh snap. We got some, uh, what the heck even is this? Two port USB charger, sealed. That's pretty sick, I like that. Three bucks, Facebook Marketplace. Some measuring cups. All right, what the heck is that, a thermometer or something? I'm good. We also have a backwoods tray. I think it's a planting tray. You, you like, you, you put soil and like, you know, flowers in it, backwood tray. There we go. We also have a license plate that I'm not gonna show. We got that Wi-Fi on deck, baby. I think I can get a good solid 20 bucks for this thing. We also ended up pulling out this Naruto movie right here, The Last. Yo, listen, we can never go wrong with HDMI cords, okay? I eat up HDMI cords, iPhone cables. This is going home with me. You can never have enough of these things. 
All right, but listen, I'm just trying to find a key right here. All right, that's that's really what I want to see. I also got these weird looking scissors. And that looks like this is it for this bin right here. It wasn't really anything too, too special. You need an iPhone cable? Always. There you go, that's all you. I want to say the coolest thing out of this was this flower tray. But Joe, let's hop back in here. What the heck is this? We got, dang, that's a nice looking drill bit. Are we, oh, yo, that's what they use to break the lock on this locker. Oh yeah. Well, Look at, like you can right see there. that yeah, like yeah. all the, uh, all the things just have a key. Can you see that? They drilled right through that thing. I feel like we're gonna end up having to do that with the safe if we don't find the key. I'm dying to know what's inside that thing. I'm hoping for gold, all right? If we can find gold inside that thing, I mean, there has to be something good in here. Who, who locks a safe? There's definitely something in there. Like literally, if we don't end up finding the key for this thing, I think we're gonna have to drill straight through this and hopefully not break anything. But all right, let's keep diving in here though. I'm gonna pick up this next bin. There's only like three, three or four bins in here actually. And guys, listen, I do wanna tell you that the uh, trade-up challenge is coming pretty soon. I'm gonna end up doing another trade-up challenge. I've been working on it like a ton recently. A lot of behind the scenes stuff, but it's coming pretty soon. I'm excited to show you guys. Let me just say what we're up to right now. It's, it's insane. So stay tuned for that. But yo, let's hop into this thing right here. We got some clothes. Okay, what kind of clothes do we have right here? Okay, okay, we got some jeans. We got these jeans right here, it's RTA. I've actually never heard of this brand before. I'm gonna have to look it up. All right, so I'm looking on eBay right now. I'm seeing some going for like 180, 60 bucks, 100 bucks, 90. I mean, these look like some legit jeans right here. I mean, I would probably never rock them. They, uh, they look a little big, but I mean, hey, I'll, I'll add that to the, uh, to the total. Let's say at minimum, we get like 50 bucks for these, I'll take it. We also got another pair right here. This is kind of cool, like a wash denim. Let's say another 50 bucks to the total right here. I never heard of this brand before, but I mean, that looks like some solid jeans right there. What else we got? We got another pair. These are jeans. I have no idea what brand this is. I don't think there is a brand or anything. The tags, I'm gonna say these are jeans from Target. No clue. Some kind of denim jeans, no tags, $3. But boom, we got another pair of the RTA jeans right here. Another white pair. You know, it's actually kind of cool. I mean, they do have like some crosses on your butt. That's actually a nice little touch right there too. Check that out. I like them. I, I think they're pretty cool. I would probably never rock them, but we'll add another 50 bucks to the total right there. But these gray ones though, what are these? They look like some Target ones. And to be honest though, I might actually, wear, I, I might wear these. There's no brand. It's just nothing. I'm gonna add that to my collection that I'm gonna end up wearing. What else we got in here though? We got an H&M hoodie. Okay, okay, solid little hoodie right here. I'm gonna say a solid five bucks on this guy. H&M hoodie, maybe Facebook Marketplace, maybe not, who knows. What else we got in here? Oh, we got the RDA hoodie, okay. Yo, dang, yo, this is actually pretty deluxe. The hoodie string has this like nice little like, I don't know what the heck that thing's called, but that's actually kind of sick. I, I do like this. This is a size extra small. Like that actually looks pretty big for an extra small. I'm not gonna lie. I'm sure we got some value in this thing. It lo does look like there's a bunch of like stains all over it, or maybe that's just that's how the hoodie's supposed to, supposed to be. I oh, have no minute. idea. I don't know, pretty sick hoodie. I'm gonna say on the low, another 50 bucks. But y'all, next up inside here. Oh, yo. Oh my God, yo, this is dope. Wait, what? What? That is sick. Is that like a collab? Starter in Rude? Yo, check this thing out. This is a varsity jacket. This is crazy. Yo, so check this out right here. I did end up finding one on eBay. This one's going for like 250 right now. I don't know if there's any last sales on these things, but I'm seeing a solid like 200 bucks on this thing. Root is a pretty sick brand and plus mixed with starter. Nice little collab right here. That's dope. <gasps> okay, one second. Oh! Oh! oh. Let's get, let me see it. Yo. Okay. Wait, wait. Okay. Okay. Yo. First off, this hoodie's coming to the personal collection. Dude, look at this. It's a Kith hoodie. That is like super dope. Let me see this thing. Why are these like tags? Oh, you know what? This is probably like a dry cleaning tag. They probably took this thing to the dry cleaner. Dude, that is actually sick. That is so, so sick. Yeah, I'm definitely not selling this. I'm keeping this because, all right, I'm not even gonna add a price to this because this is going in the closet. I'm not adding a value to that because I'm gonna make my money off of this thing right here. Dude, no flipping way. That is dope. You don't know what this is? I didn't see what you can't see the pattern all over it? Are you tripping? 
What? Oh wow, oh wow. We got the double GG all over this thing. Yeah, that's 100% Gucci right there. Yo, I, putting that one I'm definitely putting this one on. Dude, I might, I might end up rocking this one. Oh my gosh, yo, this is so dope. This is so dope. Yeah, this is 100% real. Dude, this is pretty sick. I'm gonna check the pockets just to see if there's a key in one of these things. Hopefully there's a key. I don't even have to look up the price of this because like any kind of jackets or sweaters or anything with long sleeves at Gucci, it's over a thousand dollars. Like minimum over a thousand dollars. I guarantee you, I'm gonna shoot a random price. I'm gonna say like 1580 on this boy. All right, brand new. I'm gonna say 1580. I'm gonna look it up though because this is dope. So I couldn't really find this exact one online like on eBay, but I'm seeing one right here that's similar. This one right here is going for 2,600 bucks. It might be brand new. Yeah, it is brand new with tags. But listen, even let's say used pre-owned, 800 bucks all day. All right, this is dope. I don't know what I want to rock more. This or this Kith hoodie. I'm gonna go with the Kith hoodie. All right, y'all, that was like the coolest thing out of this locker so far. I definitely think we're in the profit right there. I'd spend 300 bucks, 360 bucks. Let's just call it 400, all right? I paid 400 for this locker. I'd pay 400 for this jacket alone. We made the money up. All right, we're in the profit zone. No, put that over here, put that over here. I, I won't trip on it. Yeah, no, I don't trust <laughs> no, I don't you. I don't wanna see it in the background. Let's go Too bad, you're gonna end up tripping on it. <laughs> Talk nice to me. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hop into this bag right here. I think this is gonna be like a bag of clothes right here. What is this right here? It's underwear. Okay. <laughs> Um, I want them gloves, eh, Connor? I'm just gonna roll my sleeves over. We got a nice little pair of Hanes underwear. I'm good. What is this, though? What the heck? This is like a tiny little jacket. We got an H&M jacket right here. This thing looks like really small, like really, really small. Dude, this thing, there is no way that this is for the same person, all right? This thing is like tiny, dude. No way. Good little $5 holler on Facebook Marketplace with this thing. No keys. What else we got in here? Don't give me no more underwear. What is this? H&M hoodie. We also got another jacket, a Reebok jacket. $2. Oh my gosh. There is a lot of socks and a lot of underwear in here, and I just really don't want to touch it. But at the same time, could there be keys in there? You know, do I really, do I want to risk just digging through it just to find a pair of keys that may or may not be in there? I'm going for it. What else we got? We do got another jacket. That's dope. Adidas jacket. Would you wear this? <laughs> Size large. I, you might want to try it. You might want to try it. Oh, wait. Yo, what is this? Tong Fu Shop? What? Oh, what oh the gosh. heck? Dude. Yo, this is actually pretty sick. It looks like we got like a ton of paint markers right here. That's actually pretty cool. You know, I think there's value in this. There's definitely value, but you want them? Yes, I, I had a feeling that you yes, were going to want these yes, things. Sir. That's all you. You got to get okay. something out of the locker, right? Get my, uh, your, your Adidas and your markers. How about this? I'll let you have both of those if you can help me dig through these underwear. Nope. Okay. <laughs> all right. What do we got in here? What is this? iPhone cable? There you go, you got another one of those. I don't think I'm gonna dig through this actually. I'm just gonna hope and pray right now. What is this? We got a t-shirt, feel a t-shirt, nothing. All right, yeah guys, I'm, uh, I'm not seeing anything good in here except for socks and underwear. I'm just gonna throw all these back in here. If there's keys to the safe in here, it's gonna be pretty sad, but I, I just don't feel like digging through that. I forgot about those. That's gonna be like the cheese touch, all right? Just, just leave that, there. get up. <laughs> Now I got the cheese touch. All right, get out of here. What are you doing? All right, let me pull this thing out right here, though. Got a nice little hamper. Speak to me. What we got inside? Yo, wasn't this book in another locker? Oh, got the Croc Stomper 3000s right here. I think Jesus wore these in the Old Testament. I'm seeing a solid, like, we'll end up putting these up at the shop for free. So if you want these uh, Old Testament, New Testament Crocs, they'll be there. We got some change, though, all right? We're counting each cent that goes into this locker right now. Check this out. We could add a solid 65 cents to the locker right there. We will take that 100%. That's free money right there. And that right there is a pair of underwear. <laughs> I hit Pops right in the face with that one. I didn't mean to. All right, I got him straight in the face. Three guys quit. <laughs> That's payback. Right, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Done. See you guys. That's payback. <laughs> I hit him straight in the face with that one. All right, but yo, let's get back inside this. I just found the coolest pair of shoes. I just found the sickest pair of shoes and they're my size. Oh my God, oh my. it is gonna tempt me so hard not to wear these. Oh my gosh. Check these out right here. These right here are the Ameri, I don't know the exact like name of these, but they're Ameri, all right? That's my size too. Size eight, 
Dude, these right here, they go for a bag too. I want to say like brand new, they go for 1100. I'm sure that we can end up getting like at least 600 bucks, all right? They definitely need to be like cleaned up and everything. But yo, I might end up rocking these. These are flipping sick. Let me try them on. This is a sick lot. The fact that these are my size too, dude, it's game over. It is game over. Oh my God, this is sick. Just to show you guys that none of this is like set up. There's a site where you can buy storage lockers and we've been buying nonstop storage lockers for the past like last year i'm not gonna go throw a link or anything up because i don't want you guys stealing my lockers but, but like yo check this out you won this locker congrats we legitly do this a lot of you guys say this is faked it's not check it out right there 360 final bid that's us right there and again the only reason why i bid on this locker was because of this louis vuitton case right here but listen there's like way more inside here that i even expected these are dope these are so so dope We're not done though all right what else we got inside oh we got some fitteds. Okay, LA fitted right here. We got the New York one. That is literally the year I was born in right there. 1999, World Series, Yankee cap right here. Oh, what the pink? I don't really know too, too much about like fitted hats or anything, but I mean like kind of fits, I think. I don't know, it feels a little tight. But I know some hats, they do go for some decent money. I have no idea for prices on these guys. We also got this Yankees cap right here. Pretty sick. I, I don't usually rock fitted hats that much, but I'm sure, I'm sure we got some value like a hundred percent. I'm just going to throw a random price. I'm not exactly too sure. I'm going to say maybe like 60 bucks on this guy. These ones, I'm not too sure, but when I see that logo right there, yeah. We do got some other stuff in here. We got this beanie, nice little Nike beanie. Okay, okay, yeah, it's something I probably wouldn't rock. I'm gonna say maybe a hot $5, I'm good. But what is this right here? We got another hoodie. We got that Tommy Hill figure in an XX, XXL? It might, it might fit, it might fit. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, the color of this thing is actually pretty nice. Even though it is an XXL, I might actually wear this thing. It's, it's really, really nice. Would you rock that? I would definitely rock that. If you know what? Big, yeah. I, I will take I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a little something. I'm gonna give you a tiny little something, a little present. All right. Yeah, color with some that's stuff. your stack. But yo, that's pretty sick. That wraps up this thing right here. But yo, we're gonna dive back inside this locker. Wait, what is what this? What is this right here? Get <laughs> we got a nice little swimsuit. <laughs> Get the gloves on, dude. What the? Heck? Dad's covering his eyes right now. I wish you guys could see that. <laughs> 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 all right, we're, we're gonna throw them. We're gonna throw them. There they go. It was a swimsuit. It wasn't underwear. All right. This locker is like, this has been huge. What else? Oh, oh. Okay, I don't even know what this is yet, but just come look at this. This hoodie right here, I can just tell that this is about to be a dope hoodie because of the quality. Let's pull this thing out though and see. No way. <laughs> No flipping way. We got the Palm Angels hoodie. I knew that it was gonna be something sick because of the quality. Yo, we got the tag on it right there, Palm Angels. Dude, this is another hoodie that's huge. Yo, I'm not gonna lie too. I feel like I'd rock this thing in a heartbeat. Also, so, we got the so Palm Angels. <laughs> You can be wearing everything in here. I so, well, listen, we're, we're already in the profit. All I need to do is sell this Gucci thing and then pretty much everything's free out of this locker. All right, check this out though. We got the Palm Angels tag inside right here. This boy definitely looks legit. The quality feels great. We got the angels in the back right here with the fire. Got to check the pocket just in case if there's any keys. No keys, it's good. Yo, so check this out. There's one on eBay right now, a size medium. It says it goes for 1,080, but they have it up for 600 bucks. I mean, dude, this one might be brand new. So let's say, let's say on a bad day, we got like 250 right here. All right, that's an extremely low ball. We're not done though, all right? Okay, <laughs> we're not done. Uh, I think we ain't done yet. <laughs> Come check this out. If you guys know that font, you guys know. What do we got right here? We got that gallery department. No way. This is so sick. It is pretty small, to be honest. I've been needing some like long sleeves. <laughs> every, I feel like I'm gonna end up rocking everything out of this lock. Hey, hold on, before we continue. Yeah. Ken and I kind of agreed um, that we're going to split this locker. When? <laughs> I'll listen to you in the beginning. Come on. And now I'm not getting anything. <laughs> exactly. That's what I'm saying. Yo, I'm saying a solid 200 bucks on this thing all day. It's gallery department. Gosh, that kills me that the dry cleaner ended up like stapling the stuff on the tag. On? They stapled it. Yeah. Oh, that's easy to come out. But it, it will definitely come out, but like still, that just like kills me. That is super cool right there. I am probably gonna end up wearing it. <laughs> <laughs> 
These, we look like we got some jeans. All right, speak to me. Throw me some good jeans. Oh, we got some more of these RTA jeans. Premium Japanese denim. Huh. Okay, okay. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. But we're not done because we got a few more jeans in here. What are these? We got some H&M jeans. To be honest, I'd probably end up wearing these ones. I mean, H&M. All of my jeans, I really just don't care about. I mean, I, I'll buy jeans from Target. Now I care about them. We, I just found some quarters. Gosh, I thought that was some keys for a second. <laughs> found a quarter and a uh, nickel in there. I'm praying for keys. $5 on these H&M jeans right here. We got more jeans though. Oh my gosh. All I needed to see was that tag. No way. We got the purple jeans on deck. Oh my gosh, what happened right here? I would hate to hit that with the black light and see that thing glow, but yo, we got purple jeans inside the locker. It's supposed to be like that? Hold on. It's supposed to be like what? All that stuff? No, that looks like a, a fun night. Let me just say that, yeah. Yo, purple jeans go for a bag. These right here, pre-owned. <laughs> I'm saying like, again, on the low, on the low, 300 bucks. I might end up putting these up in the shop for like 300 bucks or something like that. Pretty much like all this stuff I'm gonna end up having at the shop and I'm gonna have some crazy steals on it. So if you guys haven't checked out the shop yet, you should definitely stop by. But yo, that is, that's huge. If these are all purple jeans inside here, this would be the biggest payday, okay? The biggest payday. Gosh, there is a lot and a lot of black jeans. What are the, oh my God. Oh my God, no, we got another pair of purple jeans right here. Guys, this is like insane. We got another pair of purple jeans right here. I don't know if I could rock them. I mean, I might, I might try to rock these. I'm not huge with the uh, toilet paper thing hanging off your butt of these. I don't really like that look. If I were to rock them, I would probably rock it without. It just looks like you went to the bathroom and like toilet paper just got stuck, <laughs> you know? I'm gonna say another 300. Another 300 for the purple jeans right here. Are these all purple? Please tell me these are all purple. What is this? Is this purple again? No, I don't know. What the heck even are these right here? Are just some random black jeans? I have no idea what brand this is. Are these right here? I, it might be like H&M or something. I'm gonna say a solid $5. I could be wrong though. I have no idea. I just didn't see any like branding or anything on these. Show me some more purple jeans, all right? The purple is about to bring me the green, all right? More H&M jeans right here. All right, speak to me though. Show me some more purple. What the heck is this? Tech stretch. Is that more h and I don't even know. Yep, H&M. H&M jeans. I'm not even gonna look at these. I'm just gonna check the pocket. Solid $5 on those. Wu-Tang. What's up, son? What is this though? This is probably gonna be like H&M. Yep, I'm gonna say a solid 20 bucks on this guy right here. Pretty sick hoodie. All right, speak to me though. We got one last pair of jeans right here. Vala balam. What, what, what? what? Dude, what in the Edward Scissorhands is going on right here? And why do I actually kind of like it? Um, one second, I'm gonna get changed. <laughs> Give me a sec. These are sick. These are flipping sick. They, they are definitely like really big on me, but I mean like, dude, oh, those are cool. come on, come on, dude. Yeah, I'm wearing these for the rest of the video. I don't care how weird it is. I probably should like wash these and, you know, cleanse everything. Listen, I got a lot of room in these things too, but dude, the, <laughs> these are dope. I couldn't even tell you what Vala Basa is, but I Vala like them. A lot. <laughs> that is so sick. I'm wearing it. Oh, could you imagine with these shoes? Yo, the person knew what they were doing. All right, that's all I'm saying. These are so dope. Yeah, I'm rocking these. I'm 100% rocking these. Okay. <laughs> this is the coolest locker I feel like we ever found. I mean, we found a lot of cool lockers, but there's like a lot of like new hip stuff in here. Like, like, dude, purple jeans. That's like the like, biggest thing right now. Plus we got like the Gucci. We got the Bum Angels hoodie. Kiss. Rude. Like, dude, this is the biggest find I feel like we ever found out of a locker. And I only spent 360 bucks on all of this. Like that is, that's huge. We still got a safe, literally. I'm dying to know what's inside this safe. There's gonna be something sick in there, I guarantee you. We're not done though. Oh dang, look at these pants. These are actually really nice. <laughs> <laughs> but Joe, let's let's grab this hamper right here and keep digging through these clothes. All right. What else we got right here? This is this is this is insane. This is the, the like coolest locker we found like ever, ever, ever. Yo, we got the V-Lone hoodie on deck right.
Dude, what the heck is this graphic on the front? That is terrifying. What, what the heck is that? Hey, Ron English. Ron English? I have no idea. That looks like some Five Nights at Freddy's bullshit. This is insane though. This is 100% legit too. The tag is good. Let me see on the back side of the... Oh my, it has the... Is it new? This thing looks brand new. This thing literally looks brand new. Scan the QR code to authenticate. This is insane. This is literally insane. Brand new V-Loan hoodie just chilling in here with the tag. I'm gonna say a solid like 400 bucks right there on this hoodie. Oh, there's the QR code. All right, like check this out. Let's scan this boy. All right, here we go. We just scanned it. Let's go. Boom. Welcome, something, something, verify your product. Okay, we're gonna skip that. I'm checking authenticity after purchase as a gift. We gotta sign in. Anyways, I think it's legit. All right, we'll take that. What else we got? Why did come with this Dude. locker got huge? No, literally, this was, this was like such a small locker and there's like just non-stop heat. Non-stop heat in this boy. We got the Essentials hoodie on deck right here. It's a size extra small, but Essentials does run like really big. This is something that I would be rocking. <laughs> <laughs> I just, right when I said that, I was like, wait a second, am I wearing it right now? I literally got an essentials on right now. Dude, look at this. There's like dry cleaner stamps all over this thing. What is up with that? That is crazy. It looks like they took their stuff to the dry cleaner all the time. I'm saying a solid like 80 bucks on this guy right here. That's huge. All right, that is super, super big. What else we got? Oh, that's a PS5 controller. Please tell me we can find a PlayStation 5 inside here. If, if we can find a PlayStation 5, there is another tote inside here. There is potential possibility that there's a PS5 inside here. Of course, I'm still looking for these keys, all right? I just want the keys to the safe. All right, PS5 controller, a solid 50 bucks all day, pre-owned. That's super sick. We got some sweatpants right here. Are these essentials? We got some essential sweats right here. Let's go. Size small. Yo, listen, these are pretty dope, but in all honesty, I'm just so like happy with these pants. These are the coolest looking pants. Solid 40 bucks, pre-owned, that's dope. This is literally like supply in the shop right now. This is so crazy. We got a hoodie right here, white hoodie. Is that H&M? We got an H&M hoodie. Five bucks, Facebook Marketplace. We got more, we're not done though, all right? We are not done. Got the off-white on deck, son? No way. Dude, okay, this, this is like crazy. Wait, wait, you, the tags or the... Yeah, the, ta tag. the tag is still on there. With the, uh, what the heck? Is there like a hair tie on this thing? What the, why? Why? Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's why the hair tag was on it. Yo, this is sick. Off-weight crew neck right here. Let me grab the sleeve hey, out of here. Which can you wear? <laughs> I am not wearing this one. All right, this one will be up at the shop for like a steal. Orange off-weight crew neck, pretty sick. What size, this seems like a size small or like a size extra small because off-weight usually runs pretty big, yep. Extra small right there on the tag. Dude, this is, <laughs> this is unreal. This is literally insane. And look yeah, at this yeah. too. 2013, we got the building right here. What does that say right there? It says rationalism with the quotation marks. I'm not too sure what the whole rationalism is, but that's pretty fire. Price on this guy, I'm gonna say 600 bucks. But in the shop, I'm gonna say maybe like three. We'll say a solid price at three, maybe like 250 as like a steal. That's that's pretty fire. I like that a lot. We're digging through this hamper though, because we are not done, baby. Ooh, okay. We got the Nike Tech. That's pretty sick. Okay. All right, wait. It says, uh, I'm not gonna say it, but there's a college on here. It's a college basketball Nike Tech right here. You know what? Techs are super hot, but I'm gonna say Facebook Marketplace, $5. What else we got though? We got some jeans. Give me some more purple jeans, baby. What we got? We don't got some more purple jeans. H&M, pretty cool. Black jeans. This person definitely liked their black jeans, all right? They were definitely feeling themselves in black jeans. Oh, snap. But we're not done though inside this hamper. Okay, nice little Nike hoodie. Okay, solid. We got the red Nike hoodie right here. I'm gonna say a solid five bucks Facebook Marketplace. That thing would go quick. This is like the ultimate clothes locker. Oh, we got we got the matching fit. We got the Nike sweats with the hoodie. Pretty fire. Let's say a solid 20 bucks on Facebook Marketplace. What else we got in here? We got another hoodie, another Nike hoodie. Eh, what the heck is this? Rodman? We got a Rodman t-shirt right here. Okay. Oh, heck yeah. That's, that's, that's kind of fire. That's dope. That's kind of fire. It's giving me like some like Prince vibes for some reason. I, I like it. It's a size large. Do you think you'd wear that? I would definitely wear that. All right, there you go.
you got another thing. All right, we got an H&M shirt right here, black H&M shirt. Eh. All right, but we got the last thing out of this hamper right here. Oh, yo. Oh, I thought that was Chrome Hearts for a second. That's actually a pretty sick Nike hoodie. I like that. I like that hoodie a lot. It's probably a solid maybe 20 bucks. Can't beat it, right? And then we also have some socks. You want those? No keys in the socks. That was a extremely good hamper. This is the final tote right here. Yeah, it's a little heavy. Oh my gosh. Okay, my predictions on what's inside here. I'm gonna say PS5. I'm hoping there's a PS5. Keys, I really want the keys for that safe. And that's it. That's all I'm hoping for. All right, and maybe some more cool clothes, but let's let's see what's inside this thing. Ooh. I think this is where we find some keys. We got a Gucci box straight off the bat. What is this? Definitely some personal stuff. Whenever I find like personal stuff in a locker, I usually put it on the front desk and let them deal with it to see if the person would wanna pick up the personal stuff. But we got a phone charger right there for Samsung. Here's a wallet. We got some like credit cards right here. PayPal cards, some receipts. Lakeside Mall, looks like that was their plug. Ooh, MJ Diamonds card. Hopefully, I'm, oh, MJ Diamonds card inside the wallet. There potentially could be some diamonds inside this safe. I'm, I'm hoping. Looks like we got some phones. We got an iPhone. Can't go wrong with an iPhone right here. Yeah. And that thing is beat to heck. We got some off-white tag. This is just a Verizon. All right, okay. Man. Okay, we also got this Gucci box. What is this? Some kind of cologne spray. These right here is when things get a little sketchy, okay? When you, when you see debit cards and stuff, things get a little sketchy, okay? In what way? I'm talking like some of these clothes could have been bought off of some of these debit cards, if you know what I mean. There's no numbers on it. Never mind. We're, oh, wait. There's numbers right here. We do have this Gucci box right here, and there's nothing inside the Gucci box. That's fine. That's fine. Facebook Marketplace. Someone would probably eat that. If, if this thing turns on, that would be pretty sick. All right, but this seems like some personal stuff. I'm going to, like, dig through this. I might get back to you guys in a second while I dig through this stuff. If I find any keys, I will let you guys know. Did find 2K. 2K, pretty good game. PS4. I just found a Balenciaga insole right here. What the heck? Okay. All right. Looks like we got some burner phones right here. Come on, dude. Oh. Come on. Come on. Please, 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 please. No flipping away. Dude. No okay. All right, I'm, I'm hoping that it's this one right here. That's the one that I think it is. We got a few keys right here though. And we got a car key right here. Yeah, we're gonna try that in a second. iPhone box, nothing in there. Oh wait, is that more keys? I got a key right here. I don't know what that is, Suicide Squad? With some pins. Okay, well, I found another key, potential. We're definitely gonna have to like throw this stuff out. Cause this is just like, like usually I take a lot of the personal stuff and I leave it up at the front desk, but this is stuff that I don't feel comfortable leaving at the front desk because yeah. Yo, listen, we do got some tools though inside here, just in case if we want to try to break into that safe, if those keys don't work. I think we're coming to an end right here. I'm just seeing a lot of mail and uh, bottles. I'll let your mind go to wherever you think I'm talking about what kind of bottles. All right, that seemed to be like a bunch of personal stuff, but there was a couple good things that was in there. Okay, got some keys. I am so surprised that we actually found keys in here. All right, guys, it is time. We actually found some keys. I am like praying that one of these keys fit in this thing. All right, I'm gonna test this one first. No, that one definitely don't fit. I know this one for sure is not gonna, because that's like a deadbolt key. We'll try this guy right here. Nope, nothing. Gosh, I really, I really hope we don't have to flip and drill through this. I'm really hoping not. All right, this one looks promising though. Speak to me. Nothing. No. All right, there's one last key right here. Please. No. I thought that was oh. shit. All right, that sucks. Um, we're gonna have to somehow get this thing open. I am dying to know what's inside this thing. I might end up just getting a drill and like drilling through this and maybe that will unlock it. I don't know, but uh, yeah, this locker was crazy. All right guys, so yo, we just made it to the house. I am dying to know what's inside this thing right here. Now listen, don't ask why, but I've picked a few locks before myself. I actually wore this chain necklace and I put a lock on it and I lost the key. So I pretty much spent a couple hours learning how to pick a lock and I actually got this lock off of my 
you know, my neck. Supreme actually made a lock and it was like see-through. So I learned how to pick it and yeah. But listen, I'm gonna try to pick this lock to see if I can get this thing open. If I can't pick it, we're gonna end up drilling straight through this thing. But I just wanna challenge myself, see if I'm able to pick this thing. And if I can, th this would just be so sick. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna try to do this. I got two paper clips. I don't have like a pick set or anything. I'm just gonna do it just like that. Are you serious? Just like that. Just You're like serious. that, you saw that, right? Just You're like that. Serious. Yeah, come on. We'll open it, let's see. Come on, come on. What's up? <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on. What's up? Hold on, What's up? What's up? Here. Just like that. That's how we pick a lock. You see that? That was crazy. You see that? I'm All right, I'm what we got in here? Oh. Wait a minute. Nothing! <laughs> what a drag. Oh my gosh. Do you see how many bands there is though? Here, let me see. Oh my god. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six. $2,000 once. Oh my god. That would have been 1200 bucks right there. God, man. Well, I mean, we got a cool safe out of it at least, you know? Dang. Nothing. <laughs> All right. Well, listen, guys. That wraps up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It sucks that we couldn't find anything in here. I was like so excited for this thing the entire time. And we were saying that we're splitting and you're still debating. Well, here, I'll, I'll, split, <laughs> I'll split these rubber bands with you. That sucks. There was no cash inside, no anything inside. But yo, we found some extremely dope things in the locker. I'm super happy about it. We didn't lose any money out of this. We definitely gained like crazy profit out of this thing. But yo, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Let me know if you guys want to see another one of these things. But yo, I love you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.